confronting biases. How can I be a voice of the people or for the people when I am not fully in support of the people? If I cannot relate to the street vendor that gets up early as 3 a.m. bustling to get their produce packed and loaded on the country bus to reach town to sell. If I cannot relate to the man who is pushing his hand cart to carry loaded produce swinging like a mad ants almost running everyone over or the woman Selling porridge and soup, every little bit of something. If I cannot relate to the man, Mr. Chin or Mr. Zan, and I assume their liberty, personality, reality, then how can I write for the people? How can I advocate for the people? How can I understand their plight? How can I join in the fight? How will I know? what's right how can i stand for the people when the system treats them rotten and they riot then we class them as ghetto how can i speak for the people when they accept and become like the system play the game and get caught in web how can i stand with the people when the root cause begins with us Homes, history, slavery, culture, government, and governments. How can I stand when we are divided by constituencies, nuances, language, status, and class? How can I stand if I do not understand my own privilege in my space and with spaces that exist? How can we coexist in this eco system if I do not confront my own biases. Give thanks. Antonia Valere.